Blue and Pink Chapter 1, Meet Blue and Pink Once upon a time, in a small town by the sea, there was a boy named Blue. He had a unique feature that made him stand out from the rest. His hair was bright blue. Blue was a happy-go-lucky boy who loved to play outside, swim, fish, and ride his bike. He was excited when the summer break began, and he planned to make the most of it. One day, while hanging out with his friend Pink, they received their summer homework from their teacher. Blue glanced at the sheets of paper with a frown. Homework during the summer break? That's not fair, he exclaimed. Pink agreed, but she decided to start working on it right away, knowing that she needed to finish it before the school started. Blue, on the other hand, thought he had plenty of time to do it later, and they both went to play without giving it another though. Chapter 2, Lazy Summer Days The days went by, and Blue and Pink enjoyed their lazy summer days. They went to the beach, caught fish, and rode their bikes all around the town. Blue's hair sparkled in the sunlight, and he felt like nothing could ruin his perfect summer break. Pink, however, was focused on finishing her homework. She spent most of her time reading and writing, but she didn't mind because she knew she would finish before the deadline. Blue, on the other hand, continued to procrastinate, thinking that he still had plenty of time to do his homework. However, as the weeks passed, he started to worry that he might not finish it in time. Chapter 3, Last Minute Rush As the summer break was coming to an end, Blue finally realized that he had only a few weeks left to finish his homework. He panicked and asked Pink for help, but it was too late. Pink had already finished her homework and was busy enjoying the last few days of her break. Blue tried to focus but he couldn't help but feel overwhelmed by the amount of work he had to do. He spent most of his days indoors, trying to finish his homework, but he just couldn't seem to make any progress. Chapter 4, Punished The first day of school arrived, and Blue was still struggling to finish his homework. He felt embarrassed as he walked into the classroom and saw that everyone else had finished their assignments. The teacher handed out the report cards, and Blue's heart sank as he saw his grades. You failed, the teacher said sternly, and you didn't even make an effort to finish your homework on time. I'm afraid I'll have to punish you by giving you extra assignments and making you stay after school for the next month. Blue was devastated. He knew he had only himself to blame for his laziness, and he vowed to do better next time. Chapter 5, Lesson Learned over the next month, Blue worked hard to catch up on his assignments. He stayed after school every day and worked diligently, determined to improve his grades. Slowly but surely, Blue started to see improvements. His grades improved, and he felt more confident about his abilities. He realized that he had learned a valuable lesson about the importance of staying on top of his work and not procrastinating. By the end of the month, Blue had completed all his extra assignments and had caught up with the rest of his classmates. He felt proud of himself for the effort he had put in, and he was determined never to let procrastination get the best of him again. The End